Hi dancers, hi parents. My name is Elizabeth Kim and I am a teaching artist here at the Dance Foundation. Today I'm gonna to be talking about props. More specifically, props that we can find at home and then build into an obstacle course. Now before I move on to that, we have a package that we're selling on our website that contains shakers and scarves. So parents, if you're interested in that, you can look on our website. All right, so now for our at-home items. Maybe you have some kind of magazine or a book that you don't mind your dancer balancing on. Maybe you have some kind of sock. You can use stuffed animals here. Your dancer is gonna tiptoe or crawl around these types of things. Then maybe we have some kind of pillow that your dancer will eventually hop over. All right, dancers and parents, let's all stand up together. All right, so on our first magazine, we are going to balance. Switch it up next time you balance. Here, parents, I'm gonna choose to tiptoe. Any kind of motion where your dancer is going across will make it fun. All right, here, parents, you can have two chairs put a yoga mat or some kind of stick for your dancer to crawl under. Here we go, we're crawling under. And then here we are going to jump over our pillows like a frog. Here we go, rip it! Here parents, you can find any kind of blanket or towel to use, but dancers know that this isn't just a blanket. It's a bridge that we're gonna cross Rushing rivers on. Here we go. Take your time. All right. So that's the end of our at home obstacle course. Now, parents and dancers, you know that your imagination is limitless. So you can do this in any way that you really want. But these are just some of the ideas that I had to share today. Thank you so much for tuning in, and we're going to see each other very, very soon. We miss you guys so much. Thank you.